Just after the funeral ended today, the Fulton County Sheriff's Office announced the arrest of Natalie White, wanted in connection with the fire that destroyed the Wendy's during a night of protest at the site where Brooks was shot. At the church, mourners moved to tears during the service, watched as the hearse began Brooks's final journey, which included a drive by the Wendy's parking lot where he died. Social justice activists often link the Brooks case with that of Ahmad Arbery, another African-American man shot and killed here in the state of Georgia. Today, the state legislature here approved hate crimes legislation. The governor is expected to approve it. Currently, Georgia is one of only four states without hate crimes. It's Laura. Jeff Begays, thank you. And there is still much more news. In the PSEV news, an extraordinary apology.